my name is Lynn. Welcome to the Deanery. Uh, today we're going to talk about an ABC quick check on your bicycle before you take it out on the road. And today's video is B for brakes and handlebars. And the first thing we're going to talk about is how you check your brakes just before you go out on the road. In order to check your front brake, what you want to do is put your hand on the lever, um, send your bike moving a little bit forward, press on your brake, and if it's working correctly, your rear wheel should lift off the ground. Now we want to check the rear one. The rear one, we're on a little bit of a slippery floor here, like you would be on pavement. So the wheel's not going to come off the ground, but it is going to lock and slide. So we know that both of our brakes are working. Um, what you want to make sure is that when you're applying the brakes, when you're riding, you're using both brakes equally. Most people use their rear one and it's not as safe a stop. So when you're stopping, you want to make sure that you use both brakes, give yourself a nice even stop along the road. In some cases, uh, you'll want to do a little bit of a minor adjustment on your brake. And when you get on your ride, especially after it's uh, been put away for the winter or you haven't ridden it for a while, you'll notice that your brake levers are coming much too close to the handlebars. So what we want to do is show you how to do a very minor adjustment that will get your brake levers out where they're supposed to be and you can get a good uh, pressure on them to stop your bike. On the uh, brake itself, on the lever, you'll see what we call a barrel adjuster. <clears throat> There's two sections to it. This actually adjusts the cable, lengthens it or shortens it, and this is a lock. So in order to get your brake lever away from the handlebar, you're going to unscrew the barrel adjuster which means you're going to take it to the left, which is loosening it. And it sounds counterintuitive, but that's what's going to actually um, tighten up your cable. When you get it in the right position, move the lock back in again, and your lever is in a better position. So we've talked about the brakes. Um, if you find that this is not uh, giving you the result that you want and your brakes are still not working properly, I would suggest that you find a good, reputable bicycle shop and take your bike in. You might have a frayed cable. You might need to replace your um, brake pads. Uh, there could be some other, <clears throat> other reasons why your brakes aren't working properly. Second thing we're going to talk about are your handlebars. And you want to make sure that when you're riding your bike that your handlebars are perpendicular to your wheel. So that when you do turn the wheel, especially if you're taking your hand off the bar to signal that you're going in the direction you think you should be going. To check this, you can straddle your front wheel, hold the bicycle, and take a look and make sure that your wheel is straight and that your handlebars are in the correct position. If they're not, sometimes you can do a little bit of adjustment like this. If not, you have um, an adjustment here that's going to loosen where your handlebars come and connect to the stem. And we're going to take an Allen key. We're going to unscrew this just a little tiny bit, not a lot, just enough so that you can adjust your handlebars to the correct position, hold them there, and tighten it back up again. That should get your bars ready for a, a safe ride. So we've looked at brakes, we've looked at the bars, and you should be ready to get on the road. If you're interested in the next section, we're going to talk about chains and cranks. And uh, please come back and join us for another Dino Project video.